Yep. Okay. <coughs> Cutscene time? No? Okay. No. Fine. No cutscene for me. I do like the music for these areas, it's quite unsettling. It's one of, uh, well, I was going to say it's one of the few things the game does right, but the game does do quite a lot right, well, sort of, at least for a, a PS1 game. I mean, let's be honest, most PS1 games were just a, a clusterfuck of random elements and random design choices because developers had no idea what they were doing. Mostly, I think. Setting aside like later title. Oh. Was that? Wait, did I just go in a full circle? Yeah, but setting aside like later titles like MGS. Yep. Oh no no no. No, I did go through. Oh, that's a good one. Uh, but setting aside like later titles like Silent Hill and the Resident Evil games and Metal Gear Solid got us one I was thinking like developers really had no idea what they were doing. Although having said that, this was released around the time of Silent Hill, I think. Maybe before, maybe after. Maybe just before, maybe just after. Yes, and there's nothing in this room, so why are we here? But it was that sort of era of, like, what are we doing? How are we making these games? Why are we doing this? Oh, it makes money. Okay, let's make this. But we, know, we have no idea what we're doing. Do it anyway, it makes money. Which is basically how every entertainment industry started, I imagine, but still. This does not look like a room I want to be in. It looks very creature friendly. I guess we'll just explore until we find something useful then. I do remember the command room as being important though, that room we went through the second floor of for some reason. I also know this is important. Wow, that's a great clue. Hmm, so I guess we need another key. So we can lock this area. Hmm. Okay, lots of dead ends. Those are great, as usual. 
Okay. Oops. Veering off course for some reason. Okay, let's try that passageway leading down then. Yeah, so that is a door. That is a door. Or a door mechanism there. We just need to find the key. I, remember, I think it's like some stairs come out or something. Okay, I probably shouldn't rush, just in case. He's probably going to pop out. Cheeky bugger. Yay, another conveyor belt. Alright. Use the two items I know work. Okay, that's weird. <laughs> oh, good, an inexplicable conveyor belt. I love these. Wow. There was a lot of purpose to get a conveyor belt. <laughs> okay. Oh right, this guy's important, as far as I remember. I thought it gave you an item or something, but maybe not. Maybe that's the control room then. And I just need to find the key for it. Right, but I can't get back. Maybe that guy does have a key. All right, yeah, I see. So, wh what did he do? So the conveyor belt's still going in the same direction. Did he unlock the doors then? Aha! Awesome. Although I'm not sure how it helps. Well, I'm not sure how it helps, like... I mean, it, it, mean, it means I can go and get out now. I'm just wondering what else. Okay, that, that's good. Thank you. Just 
wondering if it helps in any other way. Okay. Does it only work once? Do I have to go and ask him again? It would seem so. So he's just getting a, giving us a get out of jail free card so we can go back to exploring and find the, I guess, find the key to get us out of here permanently. Well, to let us roam freely. Mm -hmm. 